In computer programming, a matrix can be defined with a two-dimensional array. Any array with m columns and n rows represents a m cross n matrix. There may be a situation in which a matrix contains more number of zero values than non-zero values. Such matrix which contains very few non-zero elements is known as sparse matrix. Representation of sparse matrix Representing a sparse matrix by a 2D array leads to wastage of lots of memory. So, instead of storing zeros with non-zero elements, we only store non-zero elements. We use array that is triplet representation for storing sparse matrix. We have row index of row where non-zero element is located. Column index of column where non-zero element is located. And value value of the non-zero element at index row comma column. Now we will convert our two sample sparse matrices into triplet representation format. Row, column and value 0, 6, 21, 1, 1, 1, 1, 5, 9, 3, 2, 5, 5, 5, 3, 6, 0, 8, 7, 3, 1, 7, 7, 2. And now the second matrix B, 1, 3, 4, 3, 2, 2, 4, 7, 12, 5, 3, 8, 6, 0, 3, 7, 3, 1. Now, for adding the two sparse matrices, we follow the following steps. Select the lowest value of row from A or B. Then the lowest value of column for the selected lowest row. Add that row comma column pair to the sum matrix. Insert the value at that pair into the sum matrix. If both matrices have a non-zero value at that cell, we add the values together. Now some matrix sparse representation row column value 0 6 21 1 1 1 1 3 4 1 5 9 3 2 7 4 7 12 5 3 8 5 5 3 6 0 11 7 3 8 7 7 2 Sometimes we store the total number of rows, total number of columns and the number of non-zero values in a matrix at zeroth location of the array in triplet representation. Now this ends the addition of sparse matrices in array representation triplet representation format.